Okay, just just going to do a little game with your child. We've learned we've learned a few things about categories. We've done our parallel statements. We've done other stuff. So at this point, hopefully, your child knows a little bit about this chicken or whatever thing you've been using. So just a nice little game that you can play and not necessarily at the table, move to the floor or somewhere else as quickly as you can once the child understands what's going on. Um, so with this one, you'd look at turn taking and it depends on where your child is. This is called to teach them some skills. So you might go to your child they cheat too, so make sure everything's good. So you might go, cover your eyes. Now obviously you would prompt them to do that or, or teach them how to do that. The main aim is to get this thing under the cup without them seeing. Okay, hands off. Okay, so then you just be like, what's in here? Is it a chicken? Have a look. It's a... It's a chicken! chicken. Alright, your turn, you pick. And then they just go through that, we don't do it. Uh, right, but coming back to the, we've, we've uh, done a video now on uh, student as, as teacher, and yep. this has that inbuilt. So you take turns, I'm now essentially the teacher, even though I'm the child in this scenario, and I, I pick my one and go, and you know, I, you, you prompt your child to ask whatever question they can, can manage with their, with their vocab, and it's like, you know, even if it's like what's here or whatever, whatever it takes, and then you, you know, you'd help the child and prompt them to the point where they can, you know, act out. What did I put on the duck? <laughs> yeah, you know, duck um, kind of has and a very, as well. and a very important, and and this is actually um, a, a really cool thing because a lot of times when you like when you get the child to act it out, they're sort of going, they're going, it's a duck, it's a duck. I'm like, no, you have to give me clues because <laughs> I usually try and tell you. So that's when you might try something that's going into it very simply, something called priming, um, which is very cool. It's just, just about getting them to know everything about the thing before they, they put it in. You lose that aspect of secrecy, but you'd be like, hmm, it's a duck, it's a duck do, it does this, it's got feathers, it's got talk to three or four aspects of it. And then you might even help them with putting it under there and then acting it out. So you'd help them know about a duck. What's there? Quack, quack. Is it a duck? It is oh, a duck. I'm, I'm a genius. Um, yeah, so put a lot of energy, a lot of fun, and um, help them. There's Once again, there's a lot of different concepts and things they have to do there. And there's the game playing, there's the term taking. It's a very nice thing to do with your children. This, this task isn't necessarily teaching any uh, new skills in a, an explicit way, but it's combining so much of what we've already done into, and it's wrapping it up into, yeah, this is a really nice social turn-taking game. There's so much of what we've already done is, is being injected into this. There's a bit of theory of mind, that concept of because, you know, I know it's there, the other person has to know it's there, but of course that's not the case. Uh, there's, you know, there's labelling, there's, you know, the, the charade element is a really good social interaction. So well, especially given that often uh, a lot of our children can be bad at role playing. And that's where this sort of thing, as long as you've got a big enough cup, can, can go to things like, oh, yeah, I'm giving you something to get some vegetables. So you go into guessing games and inferential stuff and you can just build and build um, the skills that you've yeah. performed here. I mean, we're not, we haven't been particularly great role players in no, <laughs> this we've process live, so it's tricky. Got to fess up, we hate role playing. But this is a lot more fun to role play with a child than it is to another adult, so I'm sure you guys will really like this.